Hello, aunties. I have come to you with some twin facts. So, I am going to read you some twin facts in honor of me having twins. <laughs> uh, we are expecting, if you don't know by now, we are expecting Polly by Rochelle Farrell and Hazel by Rochelle Farrell. She will be reborning them both. They will have different features than what you have ever seen on any reborn. I'm pretty sure you won't be able to even, I don't think you've ever seen these features, which I'm about to put on these dolls. And I chose their features wisely because they make them one of a kind and also to kind of put my own little touch in there because I like different babies. So there's some cool things about them that nobody else has. So you gotta, gotta, gotta stay tuned for that. I really am so excited. Like it's so hard for me not to tell you guys. I think that's why I'm doing a lack of videos because it's like hard for me not to like tell you like all the baby shower crap that I have, the big items I have, like there's one over there in the corner, right, 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 there, right there, no, right there, right there, that box, that's a big baby shower item that I was really excited about that I just spontaneously bought, I don't even know why I bought it, but I bought it, now I'm gonna have to buy another one. I think I'll have to buy another one. I don't know. I just thought it was cute. But anyways, let's start with these facts, woman. So, even though that they're twins, you can tell them apart by their fingerprints and their belly buttons. Because, or their umbilical, or their umbilical cords. But I know they said the belly buttons, too. You can tell them apart. Um, the fingerprints is because... They're constantly moving around in the womb and it changes their fingerprints. Something weird like that. Um, I thought it was pretty cool. And they said, twins can be conceived by two different fathers. Which, I don't really think you would want to do that. But I have seen, if you ever watch any of those dramatic shows like Maury, um, eh, Ricky Lake in the 90s. Was that in the 90s? Yeah, it was supposed to be in the 90s. I don't even think she's... She done it one, she's done a show once before, but I don't think she's doing it anymore. Um, something dramatic like that. Like Jerry Springer. Yeah. Maury has a show that's really... Uh, it's really all about baby daddies and delinquent kids. It's very interesting. Um, there was a lady on there. I'd say she was with two different guys in the same night or around the same time and they happen to be best friends and she was pregnant and she didn't know who the father is but when she went into Maury for the test one guy was the father of one and one guy wasn't the was the father of the other and everybody was just like what so yeah very interesting um they say twins also develop their own language, their own babble. Every baby has a babble, but twins invent their own, which is freaky. Very freaky. Like, that's awesome. Twins can create their own. And also, women over 30 are more likely to have twins. Why, I don't know. But I would guess more women over 30 use fertility drugs and stuff most most of the time. Usually if they're over 30, you could start that fertility stuff. Um, and that's it. That's all the facts I found. Um, I did hear a couple more facts the other day. What was it? I can't really think right now. But that's just some fun facts for you guys. To think about and it's really cool the bond that twins have is something very very awesome um, I wouldn't necessarily say I ever wanted to be a twin I like being an only child like single singly born having my own birthday um, yeah that's it so, we are really excited about them. Um, I did show you guys the the matching hats and 
swaddle I have for them picked out. Um, I am thinking about getting a couple more item, big items for them. I'm not sure. But I do have two babies for sale. And if you would check out another video, I think it's on my other video, but they're for sale. And hello, if anybody wants to buy, any day now. I'm waiting. I'm waiting on a nibbler. They're waiting on mommies. Two babies. Two mommies. Or daddies. Just give them a call. Just give me them a call. Get those babies out of here. Um, I haven't talked to Rochelle yet. And I haven't talked to Baby Clon yet. That's the update on that. And, man, I went to the dollar store yesterday. I'm sorry, guys. But... I didn't find my baby shower things that I wanted. It's kind of disappointing. I know. It was supposed to be luau themed, but I went there last week. I think, yeah, last week to buy that. And it's nowhere to be found. It's kind of very upset. So, looks like we will be have to wait on the next season at the dollar store so we can collect that season. I guess whatever season they come, that that will be their theme. So I'm kind of upset because, you know, I kind of built that around the wrapping paper stuff. Anyway. Um, if you know of anything else that I may need for twins, let me know in the comments below. Like, I already have a double stroller, as you can tell which I put together. I put this fabric on here and then put some lace on there. Um, I should probably do a details video of that. And um, I know there's, there's these things like boppies. They're called table for two. If you have twins, look that up. That is really cool. They're called table for two. They're like boppies, but they're that big coney seat. Not coney seat, but it's, you kind of set them in there kind of like this. But they're side by side, and you can feed them, and they have cup holders on the side, which they're like 300 bucks. But I would love one of those, and I would love to find it on Craigslist or something, but it's really rare to find, so. Uh, that is another thing that I know I need. Um, I've been thinking about matching onesies, and I've been thinking about coming home outfits. Like, um, no, like, pictures pictures like you know when you get have a real baby you put them in all these cute little um little cute outfits that they do these days and like little hats and stuff oh i have an example like this like when they get their pictures taken i would love them in a little basket with this wrapped around each other um this one's one i got off of ebay a long time ago when i first started my reborns but you know and then I have these prop outfits. Oops, one of the buttons came off. I'm sure my grandma can sew them on. I have this one. And then I have this one that I found at the Goodwill. They're like little jumpers. Really cute. Um, yeah. And that's it. That's all I have. <laughs> but I've been trying to find twin props like Red Riding Hood and the Wolf. That would be really cute to like take pictures of um but I haven't I found those on Etsy but I didn't find them on um, eBay which that's where I want to really want to find them but I don't know we'll see we'll have to do a separate video on that but thanks aunties for watching and stay tuned for more